Hey guys, it's Stephanie and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you are new. Today's video is going to be a much needed pantry reorganization video. I did a whole video of how I initially organized my little pantry cabinet over here in my kitchen and it worked for the time being, but the system that I have right now just doesn't work anymore. So. It's been bothering me for weeks and it's time to finally fix it. And of course, I'm gonna take you guys along with me. I love to watch people reorganize their homes. So I figured this might appeal to a group of you out there, but I need this to be fixed. So let's jump into the before. Okay, so this is the state of the pantry. <laughs> right now it gets like worse and worse every day so this is what it looks like right now i quite literally am overflowing i'm overflowing onto the counter my what was supposed to be just one little overflow bin is basically overflowing in and of itself so something definitely needs to be done about this and it's driving me insane that every time I open it, stuff falls out. I can't even fit everything in here. So some organization definitely needs to be happening, but I wanted to show you guys the before so you can really understand why I'm, do why I'm doing this. So I think what's gonna be easiest is if I just take literally everything out and kind of sort through it and then put it all back in. Okay, so this is the cabinet all cleared out. Um, the only thing I left in there were those cans of AHA and my like stand mixer and cooling racks and everything like that. So now it's time to kind of figure out how we're gonna reorganize this. Okay, so I took everything out. It's embarrassing how many snacks I have. And I tried to just kind of organize everything by category as best as I could. So all of my candy is over here, kind of like nuts, little dried fruit, things like that. Condiments, baking stuff, soups, pasta, sorry, this is my tripod, pastas, rices, um, these like boxed dinner kinds of things. 
And then I did like my breakfast bars, oatmeal, cereal, and then like my savory snacks, pretzels, chips, crackers, stuff like that. And then all of my like sweet snacks. And then I have a couple of cans of beans over here. So those kind of just got their own little spot, but I tried to organize everything by category. So when I go to put it back in here, it's, I at least have it pre-organized for myself. All right, so this is the new state of the extras slash overflow bin, much more organized now. All right, this is the new top cabinet. It has all my really tall like cereal containers and overflow as well as some overflow sparkling water. And then moving down one row, 
This one is now all of my soups, pastas, rices, any sort of like dinners are in here. My sweet snacks, cookies, cupcakes, whatever are in here, and cookies mostly. <laughs> and all my breakfast bars, oatmeal, um, any kind of like sweet type snacks are on this shelf. And then one more down is all of my savory snacks. So all of my bags of chips, pretzels, crackers, etc. And then I put all of my baking containers down here now with my stand mixer. And actually all the way in the back of this one has my baking mixes. Since I don't use them that often, if I have to dig for them, I'm okay with that. So that's the new reorganization of this. My um, extra thing of granola bars was all taken care of. And I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna do with these because I actually was able to clean out part of this drawer by putting some stuff up here. Sorry, I'm gonna get on the stool to show you. But I have this cabinet above my microwave that I barely ever use because it's so hard to reach. But I decided to put my oils up here because I use those most of the time. Put my hydro jug up here, my lunchbox when it's not at use, and then some of the extra water bottles and cups that I don't really use but don't want to get rid of right now. Um, so I took them out of this bottom drawer where I'm literally never taking them out. And I'm going to put those extra cans in there so they're off of the floor and out of the way. And I reach for these like to refill my thing in the fridge more often than I ever reach for those extra water bottles. So I might eventually move these AHA ones down too, but for now I'm just going to do these because I'm sick of looking at them on my floor. All right, guys, so that is the final updated pantry reorganization. I feel so, so much better with how it looks now. I can so much easier access what I need out of there without knocking things over all the time. And it makes it less overwhelming to go in there and look for things if things aren't falling everywhere all over myself or I have to move 15 things out of the way to get what I want. So. Hopefully this system lasts a little bit longer than my initial system, but thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me know what you want to see me reorganize next. I'm sure there's plenty of things I could reorganize in this apartment, but uh, thank you guys again so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye.